Local Sports Show with Sports Director Blake Arthur. Well, as you know by now, our Student Athlete of the Week segment gives us the opportunity to showcase our local high school seniors who are strong students, good athletes, but most of all, outstanding people. And sometimes these kids, yeah, they're just kids, have stories that go beyond the sport, stories that really put life in a perspective. So it's only fitting that tonight as we wrap up the fall season and this week being Thanksgiving, that we finish with a feature on La Quinta's Isaiah Alvarado. Here's Bailey Arredondo with more on a remarkable story of resilience. Isaiah Alvarado is what I would coin a La Quinta OG. The senior running back has been around the school and football program since he could remember. Growing up, yeah, I used to come to the games with my sister. She came here. I would see Turbo, Benji. I grew up with all those guys, Justin Anderson, uh, Mike Avina. I always looked up to them. That's what I wanted. I always wanted to make playoffs, win the flag. I wanted to step up and right. bring back LQ. He loves football and he loves being out there and he gives 100%. And, you know, that, that's what we're looking for in, in our football players. And he's a great example to all of them. Alvarado has worked tirelessly to put himself in a position to help his team win. And he has. La Quinta is having its best season in quite some time. But his Friday nights have meant a lot more this season. First game junior season, I tore my ACL. First quarter. I tore my meniscus, and it was like flipping into my ACL. So I was like messing with my ACL, and every time I would like run, it would mess me up. You know, it's been tough for him, though. You know, he, he went through a lot of ups and downs, you know, with the injury. And, uh, you know, he didn't quit. He kept fighting. He kept working. After his first knee surgery, Alvarado leaned on his family more than ever. But the unthinkable happened. Isaiah lost his father, David, in June of 2021. Sixth grade was when he was diagnosed with stage four prostate cancer. And my grandma was taking care of him. And he just kept fighting and uh, just got the best of him. Yeah. It took him five years strong fighting. Alvarado says he has never felt an emptiness like this. Life's over. Right. I grew up like playing football. It's everything I ever wanted. I wanted to play for him. What, what kept you pushing? What kept you motivated? Um, mostly just my mom. Like my mom was always there right next to me, like making sure I needed everything. My family, I just didn't want to let them down. They all looked up to me. Alvarado honored his late father with the date and time on his back plate this season. An unimaginable time for the Alvarado household. And Isaiah did whatever he could to help. My mom was struggling with bills and stuff, so yeah, yeah I got a couple jobs, helped her out, just gave her all my paychecks. The fact that, that, you know, he's just resilient and constantly working and, and you know, we're happy to have him here. And, and, you know, he's part of our La Quinta family and he will always will be. It's not always about what you do, but how you do it. You never know what battles people are fighting. Isaiah earned and deserved his senior season. In La Quinta, Bailey Arredondo, News Channel 3. Mm. Wow, Bailey, thank you so much. Amazing story on an extraordinary young man, guys. And his father would be proud of him, I'm sure. He sure would. Yeah. Thank you, Blake.